Now this is a quick note on looking at the difference between using on and using using when we are performing a join uh, which could be any left join right join etc so here what we have is a, a scenario where we can use a dot x is equal to b dot x if both the column names are same equivalently we could also use using and into parenthesis we can specify the x column that is the id column uh, that is common in both the tables that we are trying to join for example if we have table a and we have table b if we are trying to join on the column x when we perform the join using this initial condition which is a dot x is equal to b dot x which is this one then we what we get in the output are two columns we get this x in the output as well as this x in the output so we have uh, these two columns that appear in the output however if we use the using uh, and parenthesis we specify the x which is this one in that case what we get in the output is just one occurrence of x and that's just one column in the output let's look at this uh, with an example and see how that works so here we have the table a which has column w and x with these values then we have a column as uh, then we have a table b which is this one with again the column w and a column z so the column w has the ids 1233 3 and this 2334 3, 4 in among these two tables when we perform a join using our initial condition approach where we explicitly specify a dot w is equal to b dot w in this case we are performing a right auto join what we would expect is the w column appears twice in the output so let's run this query and see look at the output so here in the output what we have is we have this w that appears once and then we have this w appearing a second time uh, the only difference is that this particular w is labeled as w underscore one just to keep the name of the column separate different than this particular name w that already exists in the output table so that's difference and if we look at the values between the columns w and w underscore one they would be the columns that are here so w column we have the output which shows the values from table a and w1 this shows values from table b this is table b this is table a and because these values are from table b on this case and this is a right join we do see that the 4 does appear in the output however in case of table a because this is the right join and this table is on the left hand side the values that do not appear in this column are not present here for example this one from table a does not appear nevertheless uh, the take home point was that the column w appears twice in the output if we use an explicit condition a dot w is equal to b dot w as opposed to this if we uh, use the using and in parenthesis specify the column that we are trying to uh, make the join then the w column would appear only once as we can see here we just have one occurrence of w and that w is from the column on in this case it's from column b because we are performing a right join as we can see here uh, we have the four but we do not have this one from column from table a which does not match any of the ids from table b in column w so that was a short video on the differences between using on with a condition and just using using uh, in parentheses specify the column on which the join is to be performed on uh, thank you for watching this video i hope you enjoyed the content so far in this series 
if you have any comments or suggestions please do let me know in the comment section below uh, uh please like share and subscribe i hope to see you all in the next video as well thank you